Kia ora, welcome to my happy place. Um, I've come on today to do um, a week five of Junk, Use It or Lose It with Kylie Coos. Um, and I had a grey moment and forgot to turn the camera on, so I, I have already cut my box. I'll have to take you out. Um, my box is a Sprite Zero um, Lemonade box which I have cut down to the side um, and I am also making a um, a box for my um, papers um, and I have um, already done my divisions to go in which will go like that um, and there basically what I'm going to be doing and um, I'm not quite sure how I'm going to decorate it yet but I think I'm just going to put a bit of paint on them um, so what colour am I going to do them I don't know I might just scrape a bit of paint around on them and see how it goes It is a dreadful day here today. Oops. Um, I have covered this with um, masking tape just so it will just take the paint a bit better. Not really doing anything fancy on it, just putting some colour on it, basically. I don't have a lot of room for um, storage, unfortunately. And I think hopefully this will take up less, less space than um, what I've got already. bit short on paints now my husband made me a um a spin, mach spin machine and i've been trying it out this morning so, anyway i will um come back when i've added all the paint and i'm sure you don't need to see me <laughs> scrape paint on um so i'll be back soon Right, I'm back and um, I just black gessoed the inside of the box and then flipped paint on it and then um, just stamped it with, um, it's a pop stand and I bought it, it was a round one and I bought it from um, Dave's Emporium in Hamilton and um, I think it cost me $4 but it makes an awesome stamp. Um, so I just did that to the inside and um, scraping paint on didn't work so I painted it and then put a bit of pattern on it for a bit of brightness so that's going to go in there like that hopefully that'll hold it nice and tight and um, oh the opposite way around actually I think that one goes there and this one goes here it took more time cleaning um, myself up than it did to paint the box and I think I'm going to have to take the corners off that Don't think about that a little bit like did it so, yeah. as I was saying my husband was making this me this spin machine and um, he didn't look what he was doing and drilled the um, bit through this part of his finger very very nasty he did yesterday afternoon but I'm, I made him go to the doctors today to have it checked because I didn't like the look of it and um, so they put it under ACC and 
just got to go every couple of days and get it dressed but at our age I don't think it's worth taking a risk of getting an infection or anything in um, things yes yeah, so that's what it's going to look like but I don't know what I'm going to do to the outside yeast I'm thinking I might cover it um, I've got some really nice um, paper that I found in a um, book in a magazine so I'll um, have a go at that. I'm just using double sided tape oh, sorry Not out of view am I Very bumble fingered today. Right, I'll just fold those back so they don't touch anything till I get it where I want it. Excuse my head if I'm got my head in the road. Right, I think that is going to go just here like. Hmm. Right there, nice and bright. Um, I don't live in the um, earthquake affected area. Thank goodness, people always say, "Oh, why do you want to live in Tokoroa?" Because it's just a mill town in the middle of the North Island and um, we like it but we have um, we don't have the extremes in weather we don't have snow we don't have um, flood excuse my head for a moment while I eyeball that uh, we don't have flooding to extreme we don't have Tornadoes to extreme. Excuse me for a minute. I might just check that. I have my own little. It's cold, and it can get very cold in the winter. Well down in the minuses, but but not um, to the extreme. Oh, and. Did you see what I did? I bet you were all screaming at me. I wonder if I can take that off without ruining it. Oh, I'm such a... old person. Spend <laughs> oh, all that time colouring it and then put it in the wrong way around. Just paint out stupid. So that is my box and um, it was Kylie Coot who um, started the um, salad bowl um, spinning and I didn't have a spinning salad bowl spinner so my husband made me a um, spinning machine he's been working on it for a while and this one here was with um, my first try with um, li acrylic liquitex inks and I don't think I did it quite right I used the brush on it so it didn't work out quite 
quite the way on there, okay. And then I used some watered down paint and um, got that effect. Oh, it went too bad. And then I started using my deco art paints and just I'm holding it up off the and letting it drop down. That was my first one with that. And that's what they've come out like. Oh, I'm really quite pleased with these. And some of them the paint was quite thick, so I put one on the top and did that, and that's the effect I got. So I was quite pleased with those. And that's the said to my husband every kindergarten should have one of these because it was so much fun kids would just love it my grandchildren will just love it when they um when they come with it so that was my spin painting hopefully they're going to fit in there i don't mind rolling them up a bit so this is what I want it for. I'll take in. And this one's over here a bit. And these ones are all go in. Oops, sorry. Just the papers in here. And that is what they will be like. shouldn't be there. So that'll hold them very tidily and I will put photos at the end to um, how I do the outside of the bo box but that is my junk use it or lose it number five storage with Kylie Coos go and check her out she's doing an awesome series getting all our bits of junk that we um collect and say we're going to do something with um, and there are lots of other ladies um, doing it as well so come along and join us um, kia kaha stay strong and I'll catch you again soon